Tonight we're also getting the chance to hear from the Virginia Beach Human Rights Commission about how they think College Beach Weekend went. And for the first time, we're also getting the number of arrests that happened over those three days. Tenor News Science Deanna Batneshi was at that meeting. She has a breakdown of some of the new information. Deanna? Well, police say the age group that got in trouble for breaking the law the most was those ages 18 to 30. The Human Rights Commission said they got feedback from the community, and overall, they said the interaction between police and people down by the oceanfront was positive. College Beach Weekend has come and gone, but it's still top of mind for many who work to keep the community safe. The Virginia Beach Human Rights Commission met up with city leaders to look over the positive and negative that came along with the annual event. Police say over the weekend there were 83 traffic citations, 85 misdemeanor charges, and a handful of felonies, too. Over the weekend, we had the sh four shooting victims. We had a report of a robbery. We also had a report of a sexual assault in the oceanfront. Deputy Chief Zaccaro says they're still investigating the alleged sexual assault and reviewing the facts for the case. The Human Rights Commission knew officers put in long hours of overtime, working to keep the resort city safe. They say feedback showed the interaction between the community and police was mostly positive. Police officers were you know, kind, they're helpful, they, you know, help folks out whenever they had a question. The Virginia Beach Police Department worked really hard to bring different groups in the city together and that was very effective. Another big topic, volunteers in the community who stepped up to be observers and who worked to be an extra set of eyes for police. People that joined in this year wanted to participate even for longer times that they scheduled themselves for. 48 people signed up to help, but even more showed up. The Human Rights Commission says they're going to continue to discuss ways to make next year even better. And the Human Rights Commission also talked about activities that could be added to keep people busy that weekend besides just going from bar to bar. Deanna Betneshi, 10 on your side.